yeah um Ibe. now um introducing you to a new um korea software a korea script with tracking with a simple front end design very simple and unique no very responsive so no problem with this for those who use it with no buy amazing look with previewed pages the about page previews the services page the contact page I will call this the pro shipping with the translator your contact or phone number your email your logo a smart site view um, now let's track um, a product and see how it looks like let's track a shipment let's log into the admin now there's one shipment here already I'll just take this tracking ID and copy it and I'll paste it on the front end I can paste it here there are two places I can put it either on the track page or on the home page I'll just track and look at an amazing tracking page now this um, shipment is on withheld and that can be changed too you can see the history like a shipment image here you can change this to anything you want it to be we already have some predefined already click on update packages and you come to package control you can change this to deliver and when it's on deliver if I reload this you can see and um, you can change this to just dispatch and on dispatch you can see so now how the process you check the dispatch the deliver and the return I'll just leave this as it held. Now I'll give you a run to the admin. Here is where you can add a package. I'll just um, simply add a simple package. Now I'm done filling the um, a shipment. I've added a package. Oh, I'll give this an image. You can choose to give it image or not. Okay, I have a Samsung TV image here, and I click on add package. Can see package has been added successfully at this point an email will be sent to the receiver giving him the information of the package and the expected delivery dates as the package is being updated the user the receiver keeps receiving an email on the update now if i come back to the front end this is a new package i created i can copy this let me copy this um, tracking id and test it on the front end now on the front end, I can use the track parcel page here. If I click, if I enter the tracking ID and click on track now. Now I look at how simple it looks. Mobile responsive. This is the image. The mobile image. There is no progress bar here yet. So what I'll do is I'll come here and click, click on update on package. Now this is the package I created with a thumb. I can choose to delete it here. I can edit the package here. I can print the receipts here. And I can control it from here. I can keep it on processing. On processing, if I reload here. You can see processing. I can leave it on check. You click here and reload is on check I can leave it on dispatch if you reload here you can see it's on dispatch and if it's delivered successfully I can click on deliver and if you come back to track me and reload you can see deliver you can see the blue and green color and if there is a problem with the shipment it can be on withheld and if you reload 
you can see at here the dispatch color has changed to warning and it's now with help which is a red sign um, this is also mobile responsive tracking page with the progress bar so let's let's create the quantity TLS um, add a history to our new shipment you can see here now there is no history yet we can click on new history the status can be the status um, can be let's see awaiting confirmation the location can be Ikeja Lagos the tracking ID is automatic still the remark still in good condition and we choose a date for that add history new history new history as we started adding an email carrying this information also will be sent to the user and when we reload here now you can see a new history has been added so that is how this script work there are a lot of lot, lot of other features but here to show you we'll stop here for now for the video thank you